Hey guys, this is the Lord of the Drinks. Today I'm gonna make you one of the most modern classic cocktail, the Cosmopolitan. So to make a proper cosmopolitan, we're gonna need the Boston shaker and we're gonna put all the ingredients into it. First of all, we're gonna use the vodka. Of course, the L. Then the control or any type of orange liqueur. One and a half CL. The third ingredient is cranberry juice. We're gonna put the three CL in it. And now comes the lime. Just the half lime will do. We have all the four ingredients in it. We're gonna use the ice now. I'm using this big ice cubes. Are you ready to shake? If you shook the drink well, you're ready to strain into the glass. I'm always using pre-chilled martini glasses for this drink. Using the whole on strainer, nicely put the drink into the glass. Last thing we need is the garnish. You can use many different garnish to this drink. I'm gonna use now a lime. I'm gonna cut a nice wedge. And that's what we're gonna use. Just like that. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the classic Cosmopolitan. Please enjoy. Let's taste this drink. This is a beautiful citrusy vodka based drink. If you like vodka, you should definitely choose this drink. It's strong but has uh, many different uh, flavors in it. The orange, the lime, the cranberry, fruity and strong. Please enjoy. Okay, now I'm gonna show you how to make my twist on the Cosmopolitan. It's called the Royal Cosmo. I'm gonna use a mixing glass to do that. And I'm gonna use uh, exactly the same ingredients as the Cosmopolitan has. We start with a nice shot of vodka. Go for the control, just a little bit. Cranberry juice, and of course the lime. Half lime juice, squeeze that. And now comes two special ingredients. One of them is the hibiscus flower and the hibiscus juice. First of all, I'm just gonna add a bit of hibiscus syrup. I'm gonna use the flour later on. And the other special ingredient is pearl dust. Usually a patisserie or pastry department are using this around this amount we have all the ingredients inside let's stir it this time I'm using this uh, crystal clear ice chunks add a good stir I don't know how much you can see this curly effect the drink has to be cold, so stir it pretty well. 
That's about it. Now we're just gonna get the glass. I'm gonna use this nice cool glass. Yeah, I just gathered my whole torn strainer. Look at this. As I told you, I'm gonna use the hibiscus flower as a garnish. Just place into this. And now I'm also gonna use an orange zest. This is a typical garnish of the Cosmo as well. Why I'm doing this? I will show you. Because uh, this drink has this uh, glittering, uh, shiny effect. I want the customers to play with it. I'm just forming the orange zest. I'll make it like this. You can add the poise around the rim. And like this, you can just stir around, enjoy the view. So this is the Royal Cosmo, beautiful pearly effect, great cosmopolitan taste with a slight uh, hibiscus uh, twist, definitely a good drink. Please enjoy, if you want to see more of these videos, please don't forget to like the channel or subscribe on it, but definitely please share it with your friends. Cheers.